I'ma keep it moving, be classy and graceful. I told him it's no friend. Hey, so welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Charmaine Latanya checking in. And I'm coming up to you guys. I'm coming to you guys today with a miniature hair tutorial. I'm about to get ready and go to work. So I'm about to show you how I achieved this um 90s hair look with the swoop bang and the flip ends. So we're just gonna jump right into it because I'm on a time limit. So I have my wig here. I'm just gonna put that on. So this wig is actually I like most people. If you search this style up, most people are using like um frontals. This is the closure. Ghetto, I know. I always say that because I don't usually like to use um I don't usually like to use closures for a sidebar. I think it's ugly, but so what I'm doing right now is just combing everything down. Out, not down, but out. Okay. Like I was saying, the stuff you'll need to achieve this look is pretty, pretty simple and straightforward. You'll just need some got to be glue spray, spray, um, a rack tail comb. You'll need some edge control. I use the edge booster and edge bust in your flat ends. So getting straight to it, what you're gonna do is pretty much just kind of um, comb all of your hair exactly the way you want it to swoop before you spray the free spray. Now, depending on how long you want your swoop to last, so if you want it to last for like a week or some days, you would go by layer, like each layer and, you know, swoop and spray the free spray. I take this off at night, so I don't really like it to be that hard and lasting for um, a long time. I usually just do my hair over every morning. So I'm only going to use one layer, well, like two layers of free spray, but on the top. So I'm just going to get all my hair nice and lined up and start to swoop how I want it. You want to swoop your hair before you spray, spray the free spray because once this gets hard, it gets hard. Also, you're going to need a blow dryer. You want to spray your hair before... Um, I mean, you want to fix your hair before you spray it because then it'll get really hard. So, I usually do my swoops like this. Okay, so that's pretty much dry. We're gonna move on to flat ironing and laying these edges. Now this part is totally up to you, um, how you do your edges. Honestly, you can do them however you 
cook butter. It's up to you and how you like your edges. Period. Like how I do mine, you do not have to do yours the same way. Period. I'm like, that's it. Just because I do mine one way, don't mean that's like the only way. You do yours how you prefer to do yours. I'm doing mine how I prefer to do mine. Everybody has different techniques and different ways they like to do their shit. So I'm just gonna take a little bit of Edge Booster and apply it to some of the hairs I brushed out. Take the comb part of my edge comb and just kind of swoop some edges in there. Okay, so now we're gonna go into flat ironing. The, so this part is simple as hell. All you're doing is taking a section, flattening it down a few times. And as you get to the end, you wanna just curl that up. Your first little pump. And then you just keep doing this throughout the entire head. I'll show y'all. And now that everything's to your liking for the final touches, um, I'll be using, and now that everything is to your liking and you have the final, it's time for the final touches. So I'll be using some liquid foundation in my shade to just clean up the part a little bit. Let's just make that a really, really clean part. I'm gonna clean it up a little bit. Then I'm gonna add these little cute little hair pins. You can get these from your local beauty supply store. I think they were like a dollar each. I think this came in a pack of three. So it came with these three. And then with these three plus this next one I'm about to put in. Oh no, it came with these two and then this one. So it was like a pack of three. And 
and for me this is the final look okay so that's pretty much it for this video this is the final look for me um i really hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial and could take this tutorial turn the style into your own however you want to do it um but this is the end of this video this is the end of this video i will um this is the end of this video so i hope you guys enjoyed it don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my youtube channel share and refer a friend and i'll see y'all guys in the next video